right all right now a few of you have seen my first um, wig video the haul I did months ago from besthairworld.com and I think I purchased three wigs one was a Lisa wig which I did a tutorial or a video on that atrociousness okay big mistake then I got two other wigs off the clearance section one of them was a mommy wig and the other was the Naomi wig which I did a video for that Okay, and now I am finally getting to the mommy wig, which is a finger wave type wig that I bought for, um, I think it was $15, $14.99. It is a human hair wig, okay? And here's the picture right here, okay? As you can see, um, yeah, she looks like a mommy wig on that woman there, and um, you might need a little vision with that. But when I saw it, I immediately thought, hmm, I can do something with that. So I bought it. So I bought her in a number two, and here she is. Okay, that's what she looks like. <laughs> you guys are probably kind of like, what? What does she know? That's it right there. You see she has all these beautiful waves in here. She did not look like that when I got her. She was flat. It looked more like just a flat finger wave. I have wet her, okay? I wet her, and yes, I'm calling the wig a her and a she because she's a mommy wig. You know, she has a name. And I refer to the wig as her and she. It's okay. No one's dying. No one's gonna get shot. You know, I understand grammar. You know, she's not a person. It's a wig. But I like to say her and she, okay? Now, <laughs> this is, you know, what she looks like. And when you wet her, she curls up even more. I love this wig. I love this wig because it does not lose its style at all. It actually gets better when you, when you um, wet her or wash her and let her drip dry. She gets better. All right, so I took okay. down the background so you guys can see the hair a lot better. Hopefully the lighting isn't too much of a drastic change, but hopefully you can see it a little bit better. So I'm going to put her on. Okay. And, right, this is the before, you guys. Yeah. Before. All right, now. All right, so now let's get to styling her, because I know you guys are probably like, oh, yeah. Now I'm just gonna kind of lift this up and pull a little bit of hair out, just a little tiny bit, that much, okay? Just that much, a little bit, not a lot. And then just comb it in with the wig. So now I'm just gonna kind of pull her out because again, she is damp, okay? If she was dry, I would be able to manipulate the waves a lot better, but as you can see, they are in there, okay? They're in there really good and they don't leave. They don't disappear or anything like that. But I don't necessarily want it to be flat, so I'm just gonna pull her out. Okay, just pull the hair out. Okay, and she is looking a little dull, but I like her to look dull because I don't like super shiny wigs. You guys know that. I cannot stand shiny, plasticky looking wigs. It just drives me bananas. Pull her out. Okay. And just work the pieces. Work it the way you like it, you know? Just like that. And this is kind of, you know, very old school. Okay. 
gonna take a little bit of wig spray and the wig spray I'm using is called O Pro. I got this from the beauty supply around the corner or not necessarily around the corner but in my neighborhood and um, the woman convinced me that this was a good spray so I don't know. It has uh, tea tree oil, olive oil, vitamin E. I'm not sure if that's good for synthetic but whatever. But this is a human hair wig, okay? She was $15. I'm just going to spray her a little bit, just a couple squirts, because I don't want too much, okay? And then just work it in with my fingers, just to get rid of some of the frizz. Okay, I'm just using my fingers, and I'm going to turn around so you can see what it looks like in the back. Okay, see that? I can't turn all the way around, so sorry, but yeah. And you see, all you I'm gonna do two. I'm gonna be doing two styles. So this is the first style. All right, pull, 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 pull. All right, and that's pretty much it. That is pretty much it. It doesn't have to be super neat. It doesn't have to be just super perfect either, you guys. It just, it's so cute to me. All right, this is so cute. All right, now, there you go. You see that? It's kind of like a pixie little style, but it's old school at the same time, right? All right. There you have it. I feel like you need something bold with this this wig because it's short and cute, sassy, classy, you know. I got these from Forever 21. I don't remember how much I bought. I paid for them, but I thought they were very cute. Um, I don't wear pearls a lot, but these were cute because they're really big. I like big earrings. So there you go. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now for this makeup look, I did do a tutorial. The tutorial will be right after this video. But this is it, you guys. This is the look. This is the mommy wig. It is absolutely gorgeous. I love this. I love this hairstyle. I might have the nerve to wear this out of side of my house. Because, you know, this is me all the way. So that's it. That's the style. That's the style I would wear with it. Um, this is the makeup I would wear with her if I were going out or something like that. Um, she definitely calls for a smoky eye, I think, and a nude lip. Um, that's an old school type of feel as well. Um, so yeah, loving her. Loving her. Look at that. Looks like my hair, doesn't it, y'all? Tell the truth. Looks like my hair. <laughs> Looks like mine, right? Right. All right, so. All right, you guys, so thank you so much for watching. This was the Mommy Wig. Stay tuned for another wig tutorial probably next week. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you. God keep you. And you guys, keep smiling. Bye.
Guess what I got new for you? 